On Wednesday, Xu Jiyong, a Chinese legal scholar and activist, went on trial in Beijing. Mr. Xu stands accused of gathering a crowd to disrupt public order, a crime that carries a maximum sentence of five years in jail. Mr. Xu, a founding member of a New Citizens movement that campaigns for a reform of the Chinese legal system, is widely known for his work on civil rights and for calling for a public disclosure of assets held by government officials. The secret wealth amassed by some government employees and their relatives has sparked anger across China and is viewed as a highly sensitive topic by the Chinese government as it tries to manage its own official anti-graft campaign. Six other people associated with the movement are also facing charges. The trial, the highest profile case against an outspoken critic of the Chinese government since the sentencing of Nobel Peace Prize winner Liu Xiaobo to 11 years in jail for subversion, has been condemned by human rights groups. Well, Amnesty International is calling for the immediate and unconditional release of Xu Zhiyong, who is a prominent legal activist and has been working for years to support um, and respect for human rights. I think this crackdown really on him and other activists who have been associated with the New Citizens Movement is really a very hypocritical step for government itself that says its goal is to crack down on corruption. Mr. Xu was once lauded by the Chinese legal profession for his efforts to uphold the legal system and was even elected to the People's Congress of Beijing's Haidian District. Speaking to the FT last year in February, Mr. Xu was skeptical about reforms in the Chinese legal system. I think his comments were echoed by his defense lawyer speaking to reporters in Beijing on Wednesday. Uh, uh, Mr. Xu's case, the latest in a series of arrests of critics of the Chinese government, is a clear signal that the administration of President Xi Jinping will not tolerate any dissent. Ben Marino, Financial Times, Beijing.